My name is Elena Beckman. I'm a research specialist in the ADRC, um, and this poster is on investigating the effect of an omega-3 fatty acid on Alzheimer's disease biomarkers in a cognitively healthy veteran population. So it's the initiation of what we're calling the BRAVE study. Um, so this study is actually just starting up, so there's no results to report, um, but basically we're looking at veterans specifically and Alzheimer's prevention. Um, veterans have certain risk factors that put them at a higher risk of developing Alzheimer's disease, um, including vascular risk factors, traumatic brain injury, um, PTSD, and depression. So it's a really important population to be studying this disease with. Um, so we're looking at how a purified fish oil can possibly um, affect regional cerebral blood flow, um, cerebral spinal fluid markers of AD pathology, and also cognitive performance. So um, using this EPA, purified fish oil, um, prescription form Vasipa, we will be administering in a placebo-controlled trial, half the people will be receiving placebo and half the fish oil. So our inclusion criteria, um, veterans between 50 and 75 with normal memory and thinking, and a parental history of Alzheimer's disease. So we've started recruitment. We've been doing so since February, and kind of the focus of this is that recruitment has been a very slow process, and there have been a lot of barriers that we've come across. We have one person enrolled in the study, um, and then I've screened about 30 people, so these are reasons for people being in a, ineligible. Um, before we changed the age, age was the biggest issue. Um, it used to be 50 to 70 year olds, and we've extended it to 75. But the main issue we're now having, and this percentage has gone up, 37% um, 37 37 of people are Ill ineligible because they're on a cholesterol lowering medication. Um, so that's interesting, and we'll have to look in the future about how to change that and improve recruitment. So that's kind of where we're at right now.